London Road, please. Well, this is an investigation that's changing literally by the hour. We have five women found dead in the space of 10 days. The manhunt for the multiple murderer enters a new phase. The feelings of vulnerability are certainly not helped by the knowledge that whoever carried out this murdering spree is still free to attack again. London Road is about a real community in Ipswich that um, came together and healed itself after a series of murders. It was created from a series of interviews that I did with real people from that community. And um, Adam Cork set some of those interviews to music by following the real speech patterns of those people. I've got nearly 17 hanging baskets in this back garden. I've got nearly 17 hanging baskets in this back garden. Believe it or not. I always work in a way that is very faithful to the way that the real-life people speak. I was a bit flummoxed at first as to how that could work musically, but then I thought, well, if I become really, really extreme about the transcription of these recordings, uh, I can actually write down the tune of the words, because when, when we all speak, we hit particular pitches, which we return to sometimes when we repeat rhythms in our speech, uh, which yield something that's almost like melody. And then we found by just repeating certain lines, like, uh, it could be him, it does become quite catchy and sort of goes in somewhere. You automatically think it could be him, it could be him. This piece is the first of its kind to be written. There's no template. There was no template for the stage show. There's no template for it as a film. They went out, they went out Tuesday, didn't they? They think it might be a verdict. And the digiting's gone down. They think it might be a verdict. And the digiting's gone down. Suffolk today's Simon Wrong. Newton has been following a verdict. It's a verdict. The pieces of work that really stand out are often ones that have come from, you know, a really unexpected source. I was just enormously lucky, and I'll be grateful for the rest of my days that that was the case, that I happened to be in the right place at the right time to direct London Road. I'd just like to point out as well, it does seem that God is smiling on London Road. Because if you've seen the weather forecast for today, well, look at it now. 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 Well, look at it now.